sounds of the unknown. When we were kids, we used to play out in back of an old abandoned house. One day we discovered an open basement window hidden behind some thick bushes. We'd always wanted to explore the old house, so we decided to climb down into the base. It was pretty dark down there. Someone found a little stub of candle. When we got it lit, we could see a trap door set in the basement floor. One by one, we filed through the trap door down several rickety steps into the cellar. In the gloom, there seemed to be a long, dark passage leading downward, deeper into the depths of the ground. Somewhere in the distance, we could hear water flowing. As we moved carefully down the long passage, flying things left over our heads disturbed at our human presence. Bats, we whispered to each other. But in my own mind, I thought the sounds were very loud, and that the creature must be really large. Still, we kept going. Now water was dripping all around us. Somebody stumbled over something. In the flickering of the candle, we saw a large bone. And there were other bones laying along the passage. Some animal must have been trapped down here, we reassured ourselves. But we wondered what kind of animal from around here had such large bones. I, for one, could hear my heart thumping in my ears. But none of us wanted to admit yet that there was something scary and threatening about this underground cell. We were now at the entrance to a large chamber. It seemed enormous. It was awfully dark, but there was a little glow around, probably from some phosphorus in the rock wall. We were hearing some unrecognizable but terrifying sounds growing louder all around. None of us could move a muscle. We could only listen to the dreadful sounds which were coming close. Someone, I don't remember who, yelled, let's get out of here fast. That did it, all right. We turned and ran back up the passage and pushed each other through the small trap door. We can still hear those sounds in our minds today. And we still wonder what made it. But I don't think any of us really want to know.